I'm going to do a review on my monthly subscription, BoxyCharm. Um, BoxyCharm is like the best subscription, beauty subscription that's out with just, you know, beauty products. Um, I have, I'm doing a review today on the base box. Um, I also have a Boxy Lux, but Boxy Lux comes about every three months. You must have a base box uh subscription in order to have boxy lux period um they also have a premium box i also have premium i did discontinue that that one was just not for me um but i still have boxy charm i still have the uh boxy lux and i love it um you do pay an additional i think 25 to 30 dollars to get the boxy lux every three months um, you can pay monthly for your subscription. You can pay every uh, three months, six months, yearly. Um, I pay every three months, I think. But this is what the box looks like. I did go in and actually use the products. Uh, I have the eyeshadow on. I use the brushes, and I'll give you my honest opinion on the products. Okay. Cleaner. Um, I actually did use it today um, to clean two brushes that I had to reuse um, that I didn't have time to clean. So, and it, it, it worked pretty good. I like it. Um, I feel like it's a must-have um, for doing makeup. Yeah. This actually retails for $19. Um, the box, $25. You see what I'm saying? It's already, I've already paid for the box. Just this one thing. We also have... Skin Fix. Let me see. This is, let's see. Okay, this is a one step face and body exfoliating pads that help brighten and smooth your skin. Okay. And it supports a healthy skin barrier. Um, they are pre soaked. And I'm trying to just skim through what it really says. Um, it does help with um, the appearance of fine lines and pores. And it targets serious skin concerns such as acne, unevenness. That is me. I have uneven skin tone um, and discoloration. And also another problem of mine. Um, this actually retails for $50. $50. Trying to, so you can see, fifty dollars for that. So again, I'm already above the amount of the box. So you see where this is already, you know, worth uh, the money. Twenty five dollars. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So next, let's see. What is this? Keep in mind, I didn't use the product, so they're they are open. This is um, Ace Beauty. I hope you can see that. And it's an eyeshadow amplifying base. Um, it's a full coverage product that should be applied before eyeshadow. It intensifies the eyeshadow colors, both matte and shimmer. Um, and allows the shadows to stay on longer. Um, I did use it and I actually love it. You really do not have to use a lot. Uh, I mean a dot on each eye and you make it depending on how big your eyelids are. You make and use one dot on both eyelids and I'm going to show you how much this product can really go far. Let's see. Mm hmm. I'm trying to just get a little, okay. Like, literally, that's all you need. Look at that. Look how much it just... <laughs> I'm amazed. Sorry, I'm just amazed. I put this on both eyelids, and I did not use a brush. I used my finger. See that? Look at that. I didn't even blend it all the way, and it looks really good. Um... This will last forever. I don't even know, like, retails $14.99. I won't have to buy this for a while because I have so much of it. It lasts way too long. <laughs> okay, and I also have some Luxie brushes. 
Mm-hmm. You see that? It's Luxy brushes. Um, okay, I did use them. I'll give you my honest opinion. Oh, let me give you these buck ugh, brushes are poor la noche. I think that's what it's called. It comes in a little travel pack, as you can see. Um, this is very convenient for travel and things like that if you don't have the makeup brush uh, carrier. Um, first off, the blush brush. It is it, it's not firm enough for me. Like, it's just I didn't use it at all. Um, I use my uh, brush. I don't even remember the name of it, but one of my favorite brushes. Um, this concealer brush. You can use this for eyeshadow or lid concealer, or you can use this hand in hand if you would prefer to use the brush instead of your hands. Um, I would use this brush again for sure. Um, this brush is the angled brush. Um, I did use this and I did like it. So the only brush really I did not like was the blush brush. You're not going to like every brush, but I may find another purpose for it. I may use it for my powder. Um, I can see me using it for that. Definitely not my blush. All right, moving along. Final item. It's about five items in the base box. Let me just say that, um, the boxy luck comes with eight full size items. Uh, Boxy Charm Base Box comes with five full size items. I cannot remember offhand how many products the uh, premium box comes comes with. However, it is premium items. I did have it. Fenty came in that box. I mean, one time we had a full Fenty box. I did like it. Um, my la oh yeah, the brushes retail for forty dollars. Um, no, I would not pay forty dollars for these brushes, but. Again, you pay $25 for this whole box, so you you definitely are winning. My next one is the eyeshadow palette that I used. Uh, so it's a little messy in here. I did use it today, and I was, uh, was rushing a little bit. So it's by Violet Foss. I did take the outer box off. And, oh, my goodness. Sorry. Clumsy. Um... It's called Violet Sunset Eyeshadow and Press Pigment Pigment Palette. I need to learn how to speak today. Okay, this retails for $37. No need to read the... Uh, it is cruelty and vegan free. I will state that. Let's see if you can really get into these colors. This uh, I, I use under my eye. Uh, excuse, I kind of messed that up. But yeah, so on this look, I did use this here. I used uh, this here. Both, I used probably every shade. So I used all four of these. Um, and this one up here. This one you see a fingerprint because I did swatch it, but I did not use it. Um, I'll actually swatch, swatch a few if you want to see. But you can clearly see my eyes and this piece here in the front uh in my cut crease is not from the palette it's um a cover fx uh liquid shadow i put um on there to brighten it up because the colors were not popping and come to think about it i really did not use this uh violet sunset I didn't use it and I'm going to swatch it so you can see. See, that's violet sunset. And it looks pretty right there, but it did not show up well on me. Purple here is the lilac so you can see that on me um, the sunset and the blush these two colors I used um, up in here up here in the crease and the champagne color here I used under here um, not really in my waterline but right there where you would put eyeliner at um, my opinion, 
I do like the palette. It will definitely not be my first go-to palette, but I do like it. Something fun to try, something that I probably will gift to a friend. Um, I probably wouldn't use it again, honestly. It's not one of my favorites, but it's nice to try it. It, it didn't hurt. This retails for $37 well over the price of the box um so yeah that's basically it my five items um usually get it about mid-month so i did have it for a few days um i'm just doing my review because i had a ton of videos to do and a ton of videos to edit i hope you enjoyed if you would like to see more unboxings from me please click the notification bell below please like and subscribe thank you bye jules